Hello, I'm down here tonight with my mate Andy, fishing. Oh, oh, I've just missed a bite then. Andy's over there, as you can see. He's fishing the waggler in the margins. And I'm sitting here, on my seat box, on the pole, fishing for roach and rud and whatever I can find. Just on the pole, on maggot. Um, and I think what I've been doing today is just little and often. And um, basically, I'll uh, go you through a rig in a minute and I'll see you when I catch a fish. Right, well, to start with, I've got on that size 18 hook, come up the line to a bulk shot of number 8 and up again to another bulk of 8 just underneath the float there. It's only a small float. Here is the float. That's on two and a half pound line. There's my pole cup there that I'm fishing. And I'm also feeding maggots and a bit of bread. That's where I'm fishing. Just out there on the edge of the island. I mean, lily pads. Dad's further down. And um, me and Andy are having a little competition who can get the most. We both had one so far. So I'll get rid of this and see you when I catch a fish. I've been having some nice roach so far. I've had six so far. Andy's had a few over there. And there's the latest one. Just a small... Lovely fish though, let's put him back. Really, I've been having nice fish. Andy, how are you getting on? Not one. Two fish. That's all he's had. Dad's had two. So let's get back out there, stop fishing. Okay. What have we got, H? Um, well, I think I'm into another nice rub. Yeah, on that bit again. It goes quiet for a bit and you get a nice fish every so often. There we go. Lovely. Coming up to the best fish of the evening. And a lovely fish. Put the the mouth there. Really good fishing down here at the club. Had a really good day at the match today with winning that. Look at that. Beautiful fish. Lovely rod. Caught on double maggot on a size 18 hook. Trying to get away again. Put him back. And he's away. Well, I've run through the rig with you. Uh, I'm just feeding maggots there. And um, about five or six every put out in the pole cup. I'll just run through the procedures that I do with you now. Um, just pull off those dead maggots there. So, a white maggot first. Just gently hooked on. Nice and wriggling around still. Followed by a red. Just nick through the skin. With maggots you must not just spear them through the main body. Because they're wriggling nicely there. Right? If you spear them straight through, they'll lose their wriggle. The fish won't see much of it. And that means you'll get less fish. Now, as you can see there, not many maggots at all. Just going in there about six or seven. Putting them in. Fishing seven metres out towards the lily pads. You can't really go wrong on an evening section, little and often. It's the best tactic these days. This pit's got a lot of rudder and roach in, the odd tension cruising. Um, but yeah, just flicking it out there to the edge and uh, tipping the couple of maggots in every time. And uh, that's basically all I'm doing, to be honest, at the minute. Uh, you've got to remember to feed the same spot. I see loads of young lads sitting there throwing a big handful of maggots in. And it's not going to work. That's why they only catch two or three fish in the whole match or whatever. I'm fishing, catching quite a few fish. So I've had my tenth in about an hour now. Fishing little and often. And if you don't fish little and often, on, on pole especially, you're not going to catch. And if you do, you're not going to catch many. So, uh, can't go wrong. Thanks. I just had another one of these roach. A bit better this time. Lovely fish, like, not massive. But, um, yeah. I hope you can see that well. 
just bring it in a bit now. Just let's just try and get the hook out. Just wait for him to unhook it. There we go, hook's out. Okay. Lovely pristine condition roach caught on maggot. Pristine. Can you see that? Yes, lovely. Look at his eyes. Right, well, uh, let's go back to the fishing. All right. See you when we catch a fish. Right, I've just hooked in and landed. A beautiful. The 12th fish of the evening. And what a beautiful fish this is. It's a this is going to be my biggest roach ever. Probably. Great Look roach. at the size of this roach. It's a beauty. I can't believe it. And it just an go app. back a bit. Okay, sorry. And Dad, do you want to come and look at this? This is an look absolute clonking roach. Clonkin. Go back and go back and. No, it's perfect view here. Look at look. that. And Dad, look at what a smashing roach that is. Definitely coming up to two pounds. It's a fish. All fish are the same fish. As that fishes. is just. Yeah, beauty. exactly. They both go. Let's put him back All in right. the net. Oh dear. In fact, let's just, not put him back just in Just chuck him back. Oh, just lob him. Oh, what a whopper. Oh, he's away. Yeah, you can still see him. So, um, that you're going to take proves, us through a bit it more? It just proves that the way that I'm fishing here yeah. really does work. Waters like this, small ponds, half an acre in size maybe. Really, really beautiful oh, surroundings. Boy. And fishing little and often in natural surroundings like this can pull out lovely roach like that. You can't really go mistaken because, I mean, I, I'm not an expert, but the way that you fish, oh it's God. all down to technique and precision. If you get all this bait spreading across the whole area, fish are going to be here and there and everywhere. What you want is you want a tight pack tight pack of bait and if that's constantly on the bottom and you're constantly building that up and keeping feed going in and then keeping the fish competing for it you're gonna catch and that was coming up to a PB roach probably was actually about two pound and that is probably the best fish I've had all day so um, I'll see you when I catch another decent fish bye bye right here's my setup we're coming to the end of the session now We've had a really, really enjoyable time. Um, I've had 12 fish so far, including a clonking roach over, over, let's say, a pound and a half. Pulled my number eight elastic out really well. Um, been a brilliant evening so far. Had the brilliant match this morning in Dam Lane Fishery. Um, won that match with five pound nine ounce. Um, fishing really nicely. And I've had some nice fish today. Just out there, where you can see now, was where I had the big roach and I've been feeding that spot over and over now. I've stopped feeding now just to go and help my dad and Andy, see if they can catch some fish. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to get back on the box and see if I can catch one more before we pack up. And um, if I don't, this is probably the end of the video. I've had a really nice evening, so um, hopefully you'll enjoy watching.